guys, today I'm back with um, a little bag review and a what's in my bag video. I know that um, it wasn't that long ago when I did a what's in my bag uh, video for my Alexander Wang bag I think. But this one is from All Saints and it's a little bit different because All Saints have started their capsule collection. This is a little taster of what's to come next year as well. And yeah, so they've just launched this as part of their biker project um, and I thought that I would share it with you guys because I was sent this gorgeous piece and it's absolutely amazing and it has pony hair and you guys know how obsessed I am with pony hair. But yeah, I'm really, really grateful to be working with them again and they are such a really cool collective company to work with and obviously you guys know that I love all sciences in general, like but all the pieces that I have from them. So... Yeah, um, let's get into it and I'll show you guys the bag. So guys, this is the bag and it is known as the Rally Mini Pony. Just as you can tell, it is a mini bag and it is made out of pony hair, which is the main thing that caught my eye of this piece. Yeah, so the pony hair is kind of in a camouflage um, pattern, which I thought was really, really cool. I thought that was a really cool touch. Um, so yeah, so start off... This is what the basic bag just looks like and it comes with a front pocket, um, it has like a magnetic clip and then at the back it has another pocket with the same clip and it also comes with an All Saints um, care card which is like this and yeah I thought that was a really nice little tie and it also says down here if you require a specific care guidance for your product um, please do not hesitate to contact the All Saints store, so which is really nice. So they offer like an aftercare service as well if something was to, you know, break. So yeah, I really like the easy magnetic pockets and obviously there's a zip compartment here. Um, which is really good to kind of like store in change or house keys just for like quick easy access. Right, so that's the outside of the bag. Um, also another little detail that I really, really like is the kind of like the metal, it's not silver, it's gun metal. And also I really like the little um, studding detail on the zip here which I thought was really really cool. So yeah, let's get into the bag. Within the bag there is kind of like no middle parting so it's just one whole space. And what I really like about that is you can fit a lot in. And uh, by what I am about to show you guys of what is in my bag currently, you can tell that I have fit a lot in and there is still extra room to fit any more things in. Yeah, so I took this out with me yesterday and so these are the contents of yesterday's day. So let's begin. I have a pair of Spitfire Sunnies and yep, they're like this. They're kind of like a transparent cat eye but it has like a gold detailing line across um, the rim and I featured these in my August haul part 2. I have a box of Spearmint Twist Tic Tacs. I have my earphones which are from Happy Buds. I have a chocolate bar which is the Dairy Milk and Oreo um, collab and I haven't even eaten ate this yet. I brought on a train yesterday just because I knew that I was going to be hungry but I didn't eat it. I also have in the little side pockets, I have my Urban Decay Miss Mia Wallace lipstick. It is part of their Pulp Fiction collection. And my Maybelline Baby Lips in Coral Flush, which is a basic lip balm with a little bit of colour in it. My business cards from Moo. And I have my purse, which is the huge Mobley Warrant. Warrant is the huge mulberry wallet and yeah so it just has all my cards and money and stuff in there and uh, that is all that i have in my bag currently so everything fits in there you can still i don't know if you can see but there's more room as well and yeah so i kind of went for this green camo pattern um over the black one just because i have so many black bags already and i wanted something a little bit different but keeping in mind we still have dark colours so it's very easy to work into my own wardrobe. So definitely check it out and let me know if you guys um, have bought one and how you guys would style it. Um, and if you guys want me to do like a styling video with this bag then let me know down in the comments below. 
and yeah my brain is going to a brain fart again so um, I will go now before I blubber on and stuff so yeah I will see you guys next week bye